<laughs> hey, guys, before we start, and I'm wound up because I didn't get to talk all week, and you know what happens when they put me in a bottle. I want to talk to you guys for a minute. Who's up in Canada? Who's here? D. Here. Who else? Jill. Jill. Who else is up in Canada? Nobody else up in Canada tonight? You guys just had Canada Day yesterday. Canada Day, and then tomorrow we got July 3rd, Saturday is 4th of July over here. And I know we have people in other countries, but you have the same holiday, guys. It's about independence, okay? People came to this country. They came to this country. They came to Canada because they wanted to be free of tyranny. They wanted to be able to worship as they pleased. They wanted to be able to earn their living as they pleased. They wanted to have the right to do as they pleased. And isn't that really what this industry is about? Yes, yes. This industry is about people making a decision to be independent. And what I want you guys to think about this week, while well, you're stuffing your faces with burgers and dogs and, you know, doing what you do, is I want you guys to get cranked up and think about independence starts in the mind. Mm -hmm. You guys realize John Hancock and Benjamin Franklin and all those guys, they dreamed a dream of independence. They dreamed it and they wrote it on a document long before it happened. And what happened between the document and the day that it was true? What had to happen? Mindset. Believe. Yeah, there was something physical that happened. They wrote a document, but they had to do something with England. What did they have to do? Fight, stand up against them. They had to have a war. They had to have a war. Guys, if you got a cell phone, hit star six, because this is important. Okay? They had to have, we still got feedback. I need a couple of you guys to hit star six. Cell phone, Skype. They had to have a war. Now, in the case of America and Canada and all that good stuff, and Mexico, you can go look down there, they had to have a war with the country that was holding them in their control. In your case, you have to have a war with that which is holding you in its control. Do you know what it is that's holding you in its control? It's not your boss. It's not your wife, men. Your mind. It is, Joanne, thank you. It is your mind. And if you are ever to be independent, if you are ever to have that which you desire, the war is yours and yours alone. Nobody else can fix it. You can't buy it. Anybody bought anything trying to buy it? Yeah. You can't, you can't get it for free. You can't do anything except fight it, and you fight it alone in your bed at night. You fight it alone in your prayers in the morning. You fight it alone in your distractions during the day. You fight it alone. The, the word for this week is independence. The word for this week is war. The word for this week is freedom. And it is solely up to you, not me, not Joe Schroeder, not your MLM, or anything else that is going to give that to you. We all fight this war. And if, if you were fortunate enough to be born into a place where you have the right to go get whatever you want, and you don't, I don't know, to me that's a sin. To me, and, and I'm, who, who, who is anybody to tell you what you want? You're the only one that knows what that is. I didn't want a Mercedes. I didn't want a yacht. I didn't want all the junk that they tried to sell me, the fantasy. I wanted to be able to be home with my babies. Really? That's freedom to me. I don't know what yours is, but I hope over the weekend 
while you are enjoying the festivities and the fireworks, that you consider it, you think about it, and you make some decisions about what you're going to be doing for the rest of the year. You've got six months left this year, six months before the end of the decade. December 31st, 2009, you're going to be looking back and going, it was 10 years ago that that millennium was changing. What have I become? What have I done? And I dare you, and I challenge you, you could do more in this six months than you've done in the whole decade if you want to. You could become more in this six months than you become in your lifetime if you want to. And you can change in a moment if you would just declare war. <laughs>